This is the part where you write down in your notebook. When you have a larger imbalance like this blue shaded one here from the daily chart, if I'm bullish, I want to see the majority of the reactions in the upper portion, which would be the premium level of the imbalance. But when you're looking for continuations, don't see this trading down to this level here in the upper portion, like I have here, the upper half of the fair value gap. That area here, a premium on a higher time frame level when bullish, when it trades back down into it, it creates what? An inversion. So premium becomes discount. That part is extremely confusing. And I promise you, we will revisit this throughout the course of 2023. Let's just know that it's better. You want to know the answers to why I know some of these imbalances are going to stay open, right? Well, I'm teaching it to you. And this is what I meant by, I just can't do a five minute trainer video. I just can't write a paragraph or a tweet and explain it. And you can run away and start making courses about it because you still don't know what I'm talking about. The whole point is, there are some imbalances that are going to remain open. Some, I want them filled. The ones in the upper half of this, fair value gap on the daily chart, above consequent encouragement, I want to see those filled. It's even stronger if they don't fill in. But the ones in the lower half, they are likely to stay open. They're better to stay open. If they come down and fill in, then it's not as bullish. And the algorithm may chop around and consolidate longer, and then I have to wait for more information. But if I see these types of scenarios here, it's almost like a loaded deal, like a lead, lead pipe cinch trade. <laughs> it's just easy. Like it's a sledgehammer. Like it's pretty much next to a sure thing that you're going to get a type of reaction like this here. Okay. And that's why sometimes when you see me trade, I can go right in there when it's just driving straight down like a falling dagger and I'll catch 